guys thank you so much for clicking on this vlog my name is the real Eleni and thank you for coming and watching my moving series we left San Francisco in the morning we were super sad to leave that was one of the best cities I've ever been to probably if not the best city and it just made us so happy we honestly didn't even talk that much. We were just so happy trying to soak in everything. And it was just such a good time. I really, really had a great birthday. And then we started the drive here to Salt Lake City. We arrived last night around 1.30 in the morning. Well, first off, we, th we drove through Eastern California. So from the coast all the way over. And then that was gorgeous. It was kind of like a deserty, but still foresty vibe. And then we went through the whole entire state of Nevada, which that was super fun and interesting as well. There's not a lot going on. It's just the desert, um, super dark and kind of scary whenever it got really dark, but we made it through all the way. And now it's super cool to see Salt Lake during the day after we came in and saw it at night. We came in and checked into our hotel. We're staying at the Courtyard Marriott. We were really hungry last night, so we went and got some Del Taco, and then we came back, watched some New Girl, and then passed out. So this morning we're gonna go grab some coffee and kind of look around a little bit more since we didn't get to see much since it was dark. But today the plan is to drive to Denver. It's only about an eight hour drive, so we have a little bit less time to drive and we can explore Salt Lake a little bit more and then not get there super, super late. So we're excited to just go grab some breakfast, check out Salt Lake City a little bit, and then hit the road again. But I don't really know much about Salt Lake City. The only thing I really know is that Aspen and Parker live here. This is what the room looks like whenever you first walk in the door. So to the right, there is a bathroom, a nice shower, <laughs> you walk in and there's a nice big TV and like I said it had Netflix which is super cool and then we had two beds last night which was super nice for both of us to be able to have our own bed and sprawl out not that I don't love sleeping up here <laughs> and then here is our awesome view that's the arena that the Utah Jazz plays at which is super cool we're downtown and that's a super pretty view with all of the mountains and hills around. But it's interesting that because of COVID, we had a different hotel booked and then they canceled the reservation or just closed down that hotel for safety reasons because of increasing cases and they moved us to this hotel. I haven't showed you guys the car. So this is what it looks like when it's packed up. So this is like my backpack and duffel. This is a bunch of pillows and just bed stuff shoes back there prioritize the fan guys always <laughs> if you sleep with the fan you know what i'm talking about i literally have to sleep with the fan every single night so we literally take this up to the hotel room every single day i'm not even kidding you and i sleep with it every single day and then yeah more pillows cords this air mattress that we had to sleep on the other night and just a bunch of other things it's a little hard to see out the back, but we still make it work. Um, and then we just have our nice two spots up in the front for us. Take turns driving, and yeah, it's been working out perfectly so far. But this is the area that we're in right now. This is our hotel on the outside. It's super gorgeous. The city's pretty pretty. The buildings are really new and nice. I feel like it's really clean. We'll take care of it well. Nice and sunny, but it's not too cold. This is what I decided to wear. I'm wearing this crop hoodie from Harry, and then just these biker shorts that I was telling Darby that I literally have had forever. I wore them in volleyball when I played in high school, and now they're like a trend to wear biker shorts, so I'm like, cool, I already own them. <laughs> and then just some band socks and my Adidas shoes. Just going for a chill look, because the car doesn't, I don't need to impress the car, you know? <laughs> That's a cute little place that we're going called Sweet Lake Biscuits and Limeade. So, for you to come. Okay, we got our food. I already ate a little bit because I'm hungry. 
<laughs> I got a fried chicken um, biscuit. It has hot sauce and honey and coleslaw. And like in the chips and salsa. There's also like a limeade salsa. And then we both got raspberry limeade. And then what did you get? It has like eggs and cheese, gravy and ham. Is it good? What do you think? Yes. Tell me. Tell them. They need to know. No way. Wow. I don't know if that's a compliment or not. No. Not for how much we're paying for it. If you can go get this at Whataburger. The view is really nice. Yeah, we got a really nice table outside. So, that's fun. Part of the experience, I'll take it. Alright. So, from the final verdict of after eating at that restaurant. Doo-doo! <laughs> it was so bad. So bad! It was bad. Like, I was eating it at first because I was hungry. And then when I realized what I was eating, it was not good. We ended up getting our food first, and then we got our limeades after. That's actually why I even showed you after, is because we didn't even get our limeades yet. And then when we got our limeades, I swear it did not have lime juice in it at all. It was water, raspberries, and lime juice was apparently in there. <laughs> But I know lime really well working at a Sonic. Yeah. And there is no lime in that. It wasn't tart at all. There's no lime all. in that, baby. There's no lime. It had just straight sugar on the bottom. Mm -hmm. My and first... he was like, our owner likes to make them that way. He likes it to be grainy. And I'm like, ugh. <laughs> like, I don't like it to he be grainy. He wants to drink sand. Yeah, like what? The first yeah. sip I got was straight sugar. And then it had so much of raspberry pulp in it you just kept drinking seeds and they kept getting stuck in your straw and I then like the food that, I like raspberries. it was yeah but it was like a lot i feel like it was half the yeah. cup of seeds and everyone else's weren't yeah yeah everyone else I that had that sabotaged us did we do something to him no i literally i don't know like as soon as we walked in he was like are you guys ready to order and we're like we don't even have menus and he's like oh yeah there's a qr code it's like online they should have told you that. No, and like, he was like, are you guys ready like, to order? Are you done looking it over? And we were like, looking what over, <laughs> Yeah, I'm sir? like, what are you talking about? And then... Like, what are we supposed to be looking at? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah. He didn't... I don't know. I can't necessarily say that the man had bad intentions. But his intentions were not... His effort was not there. No, yeah. That's what... Effort, yeah. Effort. And then he didn't even come and like check up on us at all after we got our food. Like, he didn't come and look and see, like, did you get any, or, did, like, did you get everything you needed? Does everything taste okay? He just came and brought us our checks after we've been already waiting for the check for, like, a long time. And he had, like, no tables. And, yeah, it was not busy at all. No. No good service there. No seasoning, no flavor No in seasoning, food. no flavor in the food. We are just ready to go check out the high school musical house because that's literally the only the thing that the high school musical house you keep Fuck, talking about I always that. say it's that it's freaking high school it's the high school musical the high school the high school musical high school <laughs> east high east high and then wildcats get your head in the game yeah <laughs> who are we wildcats who are we wildcats wildcats, wildcats. Get, get your head, head in the game, game. yeah <laughs> it's beautiful here yeah oh yeah super beautiful but not my butt Look guys, it's East High's 100 years of tradition. Look, this is where High School Musical was. It's so crazy. Oh I was gosh. like walking up and I was like, yeah, going to class, about to see Troy in my first hour. I'm a little nervous. <laughs> Just a little nervous. Should I sign up to try out for the musical? <gasps> oh my gosh. <laughs> Shut up. <Sharpay>. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We've been taking Snapchats with the songs playing. Oh my gosh, this is so fun. All right, one, two, three.
sleep and then I woke her up and welcome to Little America, Wyoming. The sign said 75 cent cones, so we stopped and got our 75 cent cones. Yeah, souvenirs, it is what it is. Yeah.